Okay, guys, a gadget that I have wanted to play with for a really, really long time, I finally got in. So I cleared off my workbench just to discuss it with you guys. This is a wind turbine grid tie inverter. Now, if you look on Amazon, eBay, stuff like that, you're going to find a lot of grid tie inverters and the majority of them are meant for DC input. They're meant to either hook batteries up to or to run solar panels directly to. If you're wanting to, you know, use a cheap inverter to get power from a wind turbine back into the grid, uh, you usually have to run through a bridge rectifier and go from that to batteries and then from the batteries to the grid tie inverter. If you try to run a wind turbine to a bridge rectifier directly to a grid tie inverter, the voltage just gets too crazy. Most of the inverters can't handle it and they shut down. Uh, this is supposed to not do that. This gadget is meant to run directly off of three phase power. It's got these two terminals are meant to go to some dump load resistors. I don't know if I'm going to use the dump load resistors because I think I'll just run this power back to my batteries. But we'll see. Now, this one was sent to me by Cutting Edge. Uh, this is an outfit out of Texas. Very nice guys. And uh, their, their store, I'll have a link down in the description. They sell all kinds of solar generators, panels, and supporting equipment. Uh, so definitely worth, you know, at least taking a look at their site if you are, you know, in the market for some goodies. Now, I have a couple of plans for how I want to use this. To start with, just to, to play with, I am going to run this off of either my 700 watt turbine or my 400 watt turbine. This one is meant for 600 watts is what the paperwork says, although it does not say on the inverter anywhere. Uh, my, my 700 watt turbine, I, I don't know, I think that's going to be overkill for it, but even my 400 watt turbine in the windiest times gets pretty, uh, pretty nutty. It gets close to a thousand watts by itself. Uh, but we're going to, we're going to play with it and see what happens. Now, what I really, really want to do is get a little funding together and I want to buy two identical 12 volt wind turbines. Uh, something like this is this supposed to be rated for 600 watts, so I'm going to look for five to 600 watt turbines. Uh, I want to get, like I said, two of the same model. I'm going to mount them both, you know, to, to my shop. They're both going to be in the same wind and weather conditions all the time. I'm going to run one to this inverter and see what it kicks out, and then I'm going to run the other to my traditional bridge rectifiers to a couple batteries or a battery we'll see whatever happens and then from there to one of the cheap uh, grid tie inverters that you see for solar panels or D, you know that are set up for DC input so I want to run them at the same time and see which one works better which one gives us more power so or which one works more efficiently we'll see so this is an upcoming project. I do have some other projects that I am working on. Uh, as always, I've, I've, I've got to get the tower for the i1500 back up and I got to stand the tower up for the Healy 2.0. Uh, I do have the footers in the ground for both of those towers. I am really pushing to have those up and going in the next uh, couple of weeks. And I know that I keep saying the next couple of weeks, but I'm, I'm trying to stick with it now. I've got to, I, I'm, I'm wanting to get those up and going. I'm also redesigning my inverter, you know, board where I have all my power coming in. I've got a video on that that I should have published in the next couple of days. And I'm wanting to have stuff on this coming up very soon. So that's that for now. 
I'm going to have an update on this very quickly as I have it hooked up. Uh, I'm, like I said, I'm just going to hook it up to one of my existing turbines, see what the initial performance is. So it'll be a short little update, but we're going to have more coming on this thing. Uh, as always, thank you guys, everybody who, who thought to stop by and watch this little tidbit. Uh, anybody new, if uh, you want to see some updates as they come out, please subscribe. If you like the stuff, let me know. If you have any questions, let me know. If you'd like to see me do anything interesting with this inverter, uh, I'm always interested in ideas. So. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay safe. Have a wonderful day.